What a beautiful afternoon it is out here in the countryside. Hey there, Harvey. Hmm? Are you checking if those crops are ready for harvesting? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Harvey? Are they ready? You're right. Those ears of corn are really big. Time to go and prepare your harvester. Hmm. What are those baby cars up to? They're sneaking into Harvey's field. Did you see baby Tom and baby Ben just then, Harvey? Oh. Oh. Hey kids, you're not allowed in here. It's too dangerous at harvest time. Looks like you're going to need some help. Don't worry, the car patrol will know what to do. Hey, Car Patrol. Harvey needs to harvest his crops, but two of the babies have snuck into the field. Can you help get them out? <laughs> Thanks, guys. Goodness, you guys were able to come quickly. It's already starting to get dark. Good idea, Matt. If you use your loud hailer to tell the babies to come out, they're sure to obey your orders. Mm -hmm. Game's up, kids. The car patrol is here. Time to get out of Harvey's field quickly. It's getting dark. You do know the way out, don't you? Uh-oh. Let's hope Matt has another plan. It's no use, Matt. The babies are willing to come out, but they don't know the way, and they can't see over these tall crops. That's a brilliant idea, Matt. Hector, can you fly above the field and see if you can spot them? Frank, your job is to go into the field and follow Hector's directions until you reach the babies, okay? Oh, and Frank? My painting bum bum bum. Unravel your water hose as you go. You'll see. Hmm. Can you see them, Hector? <laughs> You're right. Those lights must be Ben and Tom's. And there's Frank. Are you giving Frank directions? Great, it's working. Don't worry, babies. Help is on its way. You found them, Frank. Now all you have to do is find your way out. But it won't be easy with it being so dark, even with Hector's help. <laughs> of course. Matt must have told you to leave your water hose out so you could follow it back. <laughs> ben, Tom, all you need to do is follow Frank. <laughs> Oh, 
Frank's on his way back now with the babies in tow. Do you think you can see them, Matt? Okay, okay. There they are. Thank goodness everyone is safe. Great work, guys. You found the babies and rescued them. And now Harvey can safely harvest his crops. That's true. It's too dark for harvesting now. But it's not too late for donuts. Thanks for everything, Car Patrol. And babies? Remember to stay away from Harvey's field in the future. Hi, Tom. Hi, baby Tom. Oh, my. You don't look too good, Tom. A bad case of the flu, eh? Bless you. But you have customers waiting. You can't help them in your state. What shall we do? You're right, baby Tom. Let's call the car patrol. I'm sure they can help us. Hi, guys. Tom needs help in his garage. He's ill, but has customers waiting outside. Can you help him? Great. Let's go. I think you should go inside, Tom. The flu can get worse if you get cold. The car patrol will take care of the business. Good idea, Matt. Hector, can you fly to the hospital and get Amber so she can help Tom get rid of the flu? Okay, guys, Ooh. it's time oh. to show off your mechanical skills. Uh -huh. Marley, what's your problem today? <laughs> yes, that's a nasty dent on your bumper. But I'm sure the car patrol can help you. Oh. <laughs> You're right, Frank. Marley is very dirty. Can you rinse him off before we fix the dent? <laughs> Great. Now let's fix that bump. Tom often uses oh. a plunger. Shall we try that, Frank? <laughs> Good work, Frank. Marley, huh? you're all fixed up now. <laughs> okay, it's time for our next customer. Hi, Jerry. What brought you here today? Oh, you have a flat tire? No problem. The car patrol will help you. Great. Let's get rid of that flat tire. Uh-oh. Where did that bolt go? Frank, can Ooh. you see it? Mm -mm. Good idea, Matt. Now it will be much easier to see the bolt. You found it, Matt. Now let's fetch a new tire and put it on.
Another customer all fixed. Goodbye, Jerry. <laughs> it looks like we've helped all the cars. Uh -huh. ah. And Hector completed his mission as well. Tom, Amber is here. She'll help you get better. Thank you so much for helping Tom today, Car Patrol. You can do everything you want when you work together as a team. Bye for now. And thank you, Amber, for helping Tom. Goodbye, everybody. See you soon. Hey, Lily, uh -huh. is there a fire in the classroom? La boobie. Hi, Frank, huh? is there a fire? There doesn't seem to be any smoke or anything. Mom, I'm about that. No fire? But you think somebody pulled the alarm on purpose? Mm. Let's hope not. Okay, everyone, back inside. Thank you, Frank, for your help. Uh -huh. Uh Thank goodness there was no fire, eh, Frank? Hmm. Oh. Is that the fire alarm again? Uh -huh. ah. What's going on, Frank? Is there a faulty mm. wire or something? Mm. Oh, karaki. You just cut a wire and it's still ringing? Oh. How is that possible? Oh. Something strange is going on here, Frank. Maybe you should call the other members of Car Patrol for help. Mm -hmm. Guys, we have an emergency, and Frank needs your help. The school fire alarm keeps going off, and Frank can't figure out why. Can you get there as soon as possible to help Frank solve this mystery? Great. Let's go. Your car patrol partners are here to help, Frank. Very strange, Matt. Frank turned off the alarm earlier. Now it's going off again, even though Frank cut the wire. What is it, Matt? The alarm is coming from outside, not inside? Hector, please fly above the school and take a good look around. It seems that there is another fire alarm somewhere. Bodo, Bobby Boo. Huh? Huh? Oh, Papa. You can take the babies back inside, Lily, but we'd like to ask baby Jerry to stay here for a moment. Hmm? 
Can we please see your cell phone, baby Jerry? The one you have tucked under your front tire? Huh? You pulled the fire alarm and then recorded it on your cell phone. Then you played it back, making it sound like the alarm was still ringing. Is that right? Why? Pulling a fire alarm when there's no emergency is a very naughty thing to do. You don't want to be back at school? Well, don't ever do that again. You can go back inside now. Thanks for your help, huh? Car Patrol. Huh? At least there's no fire. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, everyone. Wow. See you next time. The Car Patrol. Wow. Hey there, Flavvy. That's a heavy load you're carrying. Wow. Are you sure it's safe to cross the bridge? It might not be strong enough, Flavvy. Uh-oh! It looks like that heavy load was too much for the bridge, and now Flavvy is stuck. We'd better ask Matt and Frank to come and help. Hey guys, we need you to come to the bridge. It collapsed when Flavvy the flatbed truck tried to carry a heavy load across it. And now she's stuck, and Charlie the crane can't come across the bridge either. Don't worry, Flavvy. Matt and Frank are here now. And it looks like they've got a rescue plan. Not long till you're safe now, Flavvy. It seems Flavvy is too heavy for Matt and Frank. Have you had an idea, Frank? Of course. You need to remove some of the heavy things Flavvy is carrying and then try pulling her off the bridge. But how? Good thinking. Can you do that, Charlie? Easy does it. One. Two. Three, four, five. That should make it a lot easier for Matt and Frank to pull Flavvy off the broken bridge. Flavvy! It worked! You're saved, Flavvy! Wait a minute. Maybe you can use the material Flavvy was carrying to build a new bridge. Charlie, do you think you could do that? Not yet, Charlie. You need to put the blocks in place first. Hmm. 
That's right, put the blocks in place first. Now it's time to lay the metal sheets across the blocks. Mm -hmm. Well done, Charlie. You've made a new bridge. Good teamwork. Everyone is safe again. And now there's a new bridge in place until the old one gets fixed. See you next time. Hi, Ben. Mm. Hi, Jeremy. Mm. You guys are working long hours. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm. You've been driving since yesterday morning? Mm -hmm. That's crazy, Jeremy. Mm. Want Ben to make you a snack? Mm -hmm. mm. You probably just want to get home. Good night, then. Mm. Mm. Oh, dear. Look at that fog. Jeremy can't hear you, Ben. He's gone into the fog. Look, there's Jeremy's muddy tire marks. Why is he not coming out of the fog? Let's call Car Patrol for help. Guys, we have a bit of a mystery here. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Jeremy's left Ben's farm and drove into a patch of fog. He's not responding to Ben's horn and hasn't come out. Mm. Huh? Huh. Can you help? Uh -huh. okay. Great. Let's go. So dark and eerie out. Car patrol is here, Ben. Matt and Frank are on the other side of the fog looking for clues. What can you tell Hector? Mm. There's where Jeremy went into the fog patch. Can you guys check if there are any tire tracks coming out on the other side? Oh. No 
no tracks on this side. Huh? That's strange. Did you hear hmm? that? Hmm? The fog is growling. The guys heard oh. it too, Ben. Is that special sonar equipment, Frank, to hear what's happening in the fog? Whatever creature is making that noise sure sounds like he's hungry. Huh? What is it, Frank? Uh, Lila. You think it's Jeremy's tummy making that noise? It could be. Jeremy didn't eat all day. Huh? But why isn't Jeremy coming out of the fog? Maybe he's injured. Huh? Matt is going to go into the fog. You fly overhead, Hector, and shine your spotlight down so he can see. Ben, you shine your high beams into the fog on your side. There. Is that Jeremy? Why isn't he responding? What's that noise? Huh? Is he snoring? Uh -huh. Huh? Jeremy is asleep. <laughs> Jeremy couldn't see, so he Ooh. decided to take a nap. Thank goodness you're okay, Jeremy. Car Patrol would like to escort you back to Car City and buy you some breakfast. How does that sound? Great. Let's go. Thanks for your help, Car Patrol. Goodbye, everyone. See you next time. Hey, guys. What's the matter? I thought you liked school. <laughs> Your friend, Baby Jerry, hasn't turned up today? Uh-huh. Oh, no. Do you know where he is? Uh -huh. Then we'll have to get the car patrol to find him. Uh -huh. Can one of you call the car patrol? Hey guys, baby Jerry isn't at school today. He's gone missing. Can you help find him? <laughs> Where will you look first? You're going to see his dad, Jerry? Good idea. Bob. Matt, uh -huh. you'd better use your speed booster to catch up to Jerry. Uh -huh. Jerry? Uh -huh. Your son, baby Jerry, is missing. Uh -huh. Do you know where he might be? Uh -huh. He might be in the playground? Good idea. The children in Car City love to play there. Why don't you guys split up and look for him? <laughs> Find anything, Matt? How about you, Hector? Can you see anything?
Can you see anything, guys? Did anyone find anything? Hmm. Matt? Why don't you use your magnifying glass to look for a clue? Still no luck, Matt? Uh, 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 uh. Hector, uh -huh. why don't you fly up in the sky and see if you can find him? You think maybe Jerry might be at the racetrack? Hey guys, Hector thinks he might have seen baby Jerry at the racetrack. You should check it out. Baby Jerry, there you are. He's right, Baby Jerry. You shouldn't leave school. You wanted to practice racing like your dad? But you still have to stay in school. Come on, it's time to go back to school now. Looks like Jerry didn't learn his lesson. You guys better catch him and make sure he goes back to school. Good luck catching him, guys. He's pretty fast. Bye-bye, everyone.